Today we're at CDK Engineering in Yeovil. Now these guys produce hydraulic seals and the tolerances must be exact. Now Mitotoyo helped them do that. Dave, could you tell me a little bit more about CDK Engineering? Uh, we started off 10 years ago um, working from home. We were buying sealing solutions in from Denmark, Austria, um, and we supply most of the food industry, uh, do a lot of the big dairies in the UK. And the seals actually come in contact with the products that are going into the pot, so yogurts, chocolate mousses, um, that type of thing. Uh, six years ago we decided to purchase a, a CNC machine in order to make our own seals um, in-house, just because the lead times were starting to stretch out a bit. Um, and we moved into this unit uh, with a, an old Bridgeport machine. Uh, which was great at the time. We then, three years ago, bought an old seal making machine, which was, again, good. It moved us on a bit more so we could manufacture um, more profile seals um, and, again, reduce the lead time because most of our customers, um, if you could imagine, uh, yogurts go off in 14 days. So if their production machines go down, they need to be making sure that the seals are there next day, sometimes even the same day. You know, I'll pick the, pick the car up and go and drive out to Leeds and deliver off some seals on a Friday evening because they need it for the weekend. Um, we bought last year, we bought a Doozan um, Lynx 220 machine from Mill CNC um, in order to do more of the PTFE products. Um, uh, it's got driven tools as well, which gave us extra capacity um, and more accuracy as well. Um, once we bought that machine, we then contacted one of our customers in the defence industry and asked them if we could quote for some metal products. They gave us um, a couple of drawings. Um, we then looked at those and quoted on them and won the contract. We then contacted Mitotoyo and said to them, we need to measure to these tolerances and they're down to 0.03 millimetre tolerances. Their salesman, Trevor Stubbs, come in and had a chat with us and um, recommended we look at our digital height gauge and our CMM machine, um, and they delivered those next day. So what sort of tolerances are you getting to with some of the seals that you're producing? The seals, we go down to about 0.1 mil tolerance. Um, the tolerance is a lot wider on PTFE and rubber components, because if you hold PTFE, it will grow with the heat or it will shrink with the, the, the coldness. Um, so that was fine. We, we were well within tolerance on those. We could use our standard um, verniers and micrometers, absolutely fine. Um, we're now manufacturing on a new seal machine. We can make up to half a metre diameter seals um, and we're in talks with Mitotoria about how we're going to measure those because they are a bit bigger and they flex as well. So specifically, why have you chosen Mitotoria brand or, and their products to help you measure your components? Like most people, growing up with Mitotoria, they're the Rolls Royce of the uh, metrology um, world. We talk to them and the help and support they've given us is second to none. It's been absolutely brilliant all the way along. We've been to Andover, we had a look at the CMM machines, we um, worked with Bernie Hall there, he gave us, um, I took my two apprentices as well, just to sort of get a general overview. Um, and he spent the whole day with them, showing them exactly what we can do. Um, we have surface finish um, requirements as well on the components, um, which uh, we've bought a surface roughness tester um, because we need to be polishing some of the products. Um, we've also purchased a vibratory bowl from PDJ Vibro um, in order to put the parts in um, and get that polish finish. On the flip side of that, we're actually using that to deburr some of our PTFE products. So some of the, the items where we were taking a whole day to, to deburr 500 components, we put them in the vibratory bowl and it's taken two hours. So, so would you say that Mitotoyo are a very big part of what you do now in reference to the quality for the customer? Oh, without a doubt, without a doubt. We had a customer come down to visit us um, last year, just before Christmas. They saw the CMM machine realised actually we can do some measurements, we've picked up work on the back of that because we're able to measure all of their components and then manufacture them. It's meant that we are able to offer them a one-stop shop. And when you're choosing your next inspection or maturity products, I presume it's going to be Mitotoil based on their backup and support? It will be. 
definitely Mr. Toya, yeah. yeah. And for the future, what's the future hold for you guys? Um, we're obviously looking at getting more um, work onto the machines. Um, our new seal making machine has um, meant that we can manufacture things quicker, more accurate. Um, it's taking capacity off the mills machine as well, which means that we are looking for work to get onto that as well, um, and we're quoting for more products. Um, we're also looking at potentially um, swapping that mill CNC machine to have a twin spindle machine, which will mean that we're not having to double up as we do on some of the components. Um, we're looking in the near future about getting a milling machine as well. So the future is very bright and obviously Mitutura are a big part of that then Dave? Mitutura are a massive part of that, yeah. yeah. And we're even looking at potential putting a CNC um, machine in for the Mitutura side of things with a measurement so that we can just load the components and away they go. Good stuff, thanks Dave. No problem.